Tonight, we are helping to get you the shot that you need when it's your turn. Channel 3's Erin Connolly is live right now. She is at uh, the United Way in Rocky Hill, where everybody is standing by to answer your calls. And Erin, they are already getting a lot of phone calls every day. So many phone calls every day. In fact, I said this earlier, but they reached a big milestone this morning, having answering more than 100,000 calls. Just think about that. Think about how much effort goes into that and how many people's answers, uh, how many people got answers because of that. They also have been able to schedule nearly 40,000 appointments. So this really works. It really does. And right now I want to bring in, this is Dr. Marwan Haddad, and I want to get this right because it's a mouthful. You are the medical director of the Center for Key Populations for the Community Health Center. Yes. Thank you so much for being with us. My pleasure. We've talked so many times about there is still a population out there who may be reticent to get the vaccine. What do you say to them? You know, I, I'd like to say that these are safe and extremely effective as a vaccine that we've we've seen in a you know very long time and so i want to reassure them that these have been very well studied with rigorous sort of trials to really determine that we're talking about 95 percent effectiveness and and that's really incredible for a vaccine um and i think the number one message also i'd like to to sort of say is anybody who's been vaccinated in these trials have had zero hospitalizations and zero deaths and so they really really protect the individual who gets vaccinated. We were talking about this earlier. There are a lot of myths out there on the internet. Yes. There are a lot of untruths. Dispel some of the big ones for us. Sure. I think initially everybody was uh, worried that it, they were developed so quickly, right? They, 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 they came about so, so fast and they were worried that the corners were cut. And that's not the case. Like I sort of said, they were really good, large trials that were done and, and, and the FDA really sort of reviewed all the science and, and as we have been seeing, it's really extremely effective. So I think one, less, uh, one sort of uh, thing to sort of say is they, they, no corners were cut. Secondly, I think people were worried about messenger RNA and what does that mean and is that going to be, is it going to change my DNA? And the messenger RNA just delivers a small little protein to us and then disintegrates and gets out of our body. It never comes near our DNA and never gets uh, incorporated into our bodies at all. As a doctor, I imagine that you have gotten a number of questions from patients. What are the biggest things that people are still grappling, grappling with and trying to understand about these vaccines. Sure, and I think they're, now that the vaccines are, are have, have many people have started getting the vaccines, they're worried about the side effects. They don't want the side effects. They're worried that the side effects may indicate that something's wrong with their body. And I want to reassure them that these vaccines are very what we call reactogenic. And that's exactly what we want, right? If you get the side effects, it means that your body is mounting that immune response that we need to fight off the, the COVID infection if you end up seeing it. So I think those side effects that you get, whether it's the headache, the achiness, uh, the fatigue, those are all, all good signs that your immune system has responded to the vaccine. And lastly, as a doctor, seeing the work being done here and the amount of people this has helped, how valuable is that? Extremely valuable. I mean, the only way that we can get ahead of the, uh, this pandemic is to get people vaccinated. And we need to make it much more accessible to people. And I know that people have struggled with the VAMs and getting on the internet and the email. So having this 211 is, is really extremely important for people to get through and get the appointments to get in and get vaccinated. It has made a hard process much, much easier. easier. So that is great to get the word out. Dr. Marwan Haddad, thank you so much for being with us and thank you so much to everything that you and your colleagues have been doing really since the start of this pandemic. True heroes. Thank you. So thank you. And again, we have that number at the bottom of your screen. It is 877-918-2224. Get your vaccine questions answered. If you are eligible, call to help make your appointment. That is what they are here for. This is one-stop shopping. It is a great resource. And if you don't need the information in particular, maybe you have a neighbor who does. Maybe you have a grandparent. Maybe you know someone who's struggling right now. Share this information, pass it along. Let's all work together as we have been doing for the last year or so now. Mark? Yeah, we're all ready to move on. That's for sure, Aaron. And we also need to make sure people keep in mind that, you know, the individuals <laughs> working there, th be patient with them. They're also living through this pandemic and trying to get everybody help and help their own families, too. So. Absolutely. I think we've all been through a myriad of emotions over the past year, and there is somewhat of an end in sight now. But 
Yes, keep in mind they are here from 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. It's 125 people. They are trying to get to as many calls as they can. And please know that if you can't reach them and you do leave a voicemail, you will get a return call back. So don't be upset if you have to leave a voicemail. I'm here promising you right now, everyone will get a return call back. So that is not something you have to worry about. All right, Aaron, we'll see.